Hello and welcome to Alpha Motors here in Wigan. Today I've got the absolute pleasure of showing you around this Range Rover Evoque D150 on it. It's on a 70 plate and the car itself is finished in Fuji white paintwork which is probably one of the best colour combinations for this car and also the added nice optional extra of the contrast black roof and mirrors has been added as an option. But taking a closer look round then, you've got the Range Rover badging on the front bonnet and when you take a closer look at the bonnet it's free from any major stone chips. You've got the lovely chrome detail in there in the centre grille. On this one you've got front parking sensors which will be displayed when you're driving on the radio screen coming down then the side we're riding on these lovely 18 inch five split spoke alloy wheels and they're in lovely order all round and running on lovely tires all round as well but taking a close look then down the side it's free from any major dents or scratches as i've said it's got the lovely optional extra of the contrast black roof and mirrors which really does set it apart and also with this one it has got privacy glass as well but coming through to the rear you've got the range rover badging on the bootlid you've got the evoke and then the spec and model there which saw d150s you've got the lovely satin silver rear sporter diffuser on this one you've got the rear parking sensors and also a reversing camera as well taking a close look then into the boot it is a manual tailgate on this one, so you just press the button and lift it up. Parcel shelf is present. You've got 60 40 split folding rear seats. And then for luggage space, you do get plenty of luggage space in these Evokes as well. And then taking a closer look at the top of the bumper into the plastic, that is all in good order. So it's not on any pets or anything jumping in and scratching the paintwork and the trim. But under the boot mat there, you do get your tire inflation kit, your tow and eye cover as well. Coming in down the passenger side again, looking down, it's all in good order throughout. There's no signs of any dints, all the bumpers are in good order. Same with the passenger rear wheel, that is in good order as well. And then taking a look down the door edges, they're all in good order as well. Free from any chips on any walls and things like that. Looking at the passenger rear door as well, that is all in good order. And again, passenger front wheel, that is all in lovely order as well. But taking a closer look at your sign then now, we'll run through some of the specification on this one but I'll quickly show you through to the rear. So when you jump inside, you're greeted with this lovely ebony perforated leather interior, uh, but looking at all the back seats, they're all in good order, free from any rips. You've got your arsehole fix on this one. And then looking at the back of the both seats, they're all in good order as well. They look like they've been kicked or scratched and things like that. We're jumping inside and running through specification wise. You've got four electric windows on this one, power fold mirrors. This button here is your child safety lock, so the rear windows can't go down or children can't open the rear doors. You've got electric front seats for both passenger and driver. But running through inside now, you do get a lovely sense of occasion with this one. It is all in good order. The passenger seats in good order. And like I said, you get the lovely gloss black aluminium detailing throughout. But as we're doing the video today, the car has only covered 35,633 miles. And you get this lovely leather multifunctional steering wheel which again taking a closer look right is all in good order you've got auto wipers on this one and auto lights you've got your trip computer controls here which controls all the center display so you can change the died display in the center so at the minute it's set on digital speed or you get traffic sound recognition with this one and then coming through to the side you do get lane keep assist cruise and limit control coming through then to the radio this is all touchscreen so you get satellite navigation which again can go all to the full screen which is very easy and super responsive going back then you've got media so you've got full dab radio on this one so you get all the extended channels flicking back through you get phone so full bluetooth connectivity and flicking through you get apple carplay and android auto and then here's your super bluetooth settings vehicle dimensions voice and things like that but if we pop it into reverse there's a reversing camera in order and then when you do you get close to the desired object they see displays how close you are as like so and then coming through into the climate controls you've got heated seats on this one so to operate the heated seats just press this button in on both sides just press it and then turn it left or right to desire which temperature you may require heated front windscreen heated rear windscreen air conditioning and then to control the fan blow you just press the fan button and turn that dial and the same for which angle you would like to have your uh, input out but we're right on this lovely six-speed manual gearbox and again looking around all the gloss black trim 
in the top of the gear stick it is in good order for a while extended storage cover on top if you remove that you've got two cup holders under there and then in the center armrest you have your usb and 12 volt power outlet but it is a really nice working car for it and as we're doing the video today the car is supplied with two keys well i had a really nice looking car just come into stock at the beginning of the week and now we'll be fully advertised later on but please don't hesitate to give us a call on 01942 231123 or email us at sales at alphamotors.co.uk and thanks for watching